Uh, hello everyone. Uh, welcome to Thinker Studio. My name is Professor Mahamani. So I am a researcher, innovator and engineering teacher. Uh, so this video I am giving to you to prepare yourself at home. Uh, when coming to laboratory straight away you can start your experiment and do various modification in the circuit and uh, uh, the understanding the concept. The how Thinker Lab is differ from conventional so that uh, difference it is given. Primary focus is creativity, innovation and problem solving. Whereas the conventional lab, uh, it will reinforce the theoretical concept, accuracy and procedure. Here the activity is designing and building one project. Whereas uh, conventional lab, we will follow some set of standard procedure. And uh, the outcome for this uh, Tinker lab is preparation for real world challenges and innovation. Conventional lab strengthening the foundational knowledge. In summary, if you take a Tinker Lab, prepare the students for real world challenges and innovation, while conventional lab strengthens the theoretical understanding and the procedural skill. So, this is the, uh, uh, it's a subject recently added into JNQ curriculum in third year. The core subjectives are listed. Uh, there are 13 experiments, two from 3D printing, others from uh, all are from electronics and IoT. Here, the, if you look at the Bloom's taxonomy, this particular Thinker Lab, it will uh, help you to build a prototype and test. You modify the modify in prototype and test. So, this will help you to uh, better understanding than conventional. Coming to experiment, construct series and parallel circuit using breadboard for LED application. So, here you have a, a series circuit and parallel circuit. Series circuit, all components are connected end to end, that is one after other. Current uh, is same through all the component and voltage is divided across the component. Uh, here the problem is if one component fails in series circuit, everything will fail. Coming to parallel circuit, all components have uh, same voltage across them, whereas the current split, uh, split based on the resistance. So here parallel circuit, if one component failed, other continue to work. So this is the advantage. Coming to real world significance, series connection, it will be used to hold the decorative light uh, it is used in simply uh, simple wiring. If one fails in the series, every day, uh, the complete circuit will fail. Whereas travel uh, parallel, it is used uh, home lighting, electronics, uh, independent device control is advantage. Slightly complex when compared to series. So this is the basic diagram for series and uh, parallel circuit. Here three LEDs are given. Whereas uh, the experiment we are using only two LEDs. These are all the component list you can see. So, first of all, uh, the circuit diagram, you can use uh, series circuit of two LED, one register, parallel circuit, two LED, each with one register. So, here uh, the we are using go to this link, you can register yourself, you create an account in Tinkercad. So, therefore, uh, you can go for virtual. This video, we are going to uh, demonstrate the virtual lab as well as the conventional one, conventional kit also. Uh, this is the procedure for... Uh, uh, connecting, conduct, uh, constructing series circuit and parallel circuit. So here the uh, anode of LED, cathode of LED2, then uh, place a 220 ohm register, then connect positive terminal 9 volt battery, complete the circuit by connecting negative terminal. So after observe the brightness of LED. So here same thing, connect uh, 220 ohm register in, seri in, in series with uh, each LED, connect all LED register pair across the positive and negative power rails. And this is the observation table. You can measure the voltage across LED1, LED2 for a fourth series and parallel circuit. Record it. So here you will get the dim light. Here you will get a brighter light. So if you remove one LED, entire circuit will switch off. Other whereas panel, it will work. So this uh, description it is given. This observation it will be given. So finally, conclusion for uh, this is parallel circuit are better suited for application requiring independent uh, device control and consistent brightness. brightness. The application, the home lighting, tire, home lighting, LED signboard, emergency lighting, they are using the uh, parallel circuit. Whereas only tie circuit they are using uh, series. The viva questions are listed. The extension of uh, project idea, this is the new component that is very much important. That will distinct uh, the conventional lab with the uh, Tinker Cap lab. Uh, the mark division, Tinker Cap 20%, kit observation 30%. Project and extension 30. So, project extension means this one. Yeah, we are talking about this. And YWA 20%, total 100% uh, mark, it is distributed. 